Typhon killed Gabe. I have proof. What proof? I stole it from Diane. Emails and documents proving there was a second explosion the night Gabe died. To cover something up, Jed. Some secret they buried. I don't know what it is. I don't even know what to do next. But I'm not giving up. Not ever. I know what they're hiding. Oh? Hold up. Please, Jed. What's the truth? What are they afraid of? Typhon's the devil that runs this town. I've been carrying their secrets for far too long. I know what they buried in the mountains. Tell me. I'll do one better. I'll show you. Uh, you said you have some news? I'm leaving. I'm actually leaving Haven Springs. What? Can you believe it? Back on the road again. Fucking finally. Wait, seriously? I'm gonna play music again, Alex. Anywhere I want. God, I forgot how fucking good it feels. <sighs> hmm. Holy shit, Steph, that's so cool. I'm really happy for you. You better keep in touch. You think it's that easy to get rid of me? Come on, Chen. I need a new destination. You're my good luck charm. You have shit taste in good luck charms. <laughs> Shut up. Pick one. Huh. Let's see. The middle of the ocean. Berlin. Hmm. Salem, Massachusetts. Let's see. Let's actually go for something a bit closer. I guess a little bit closer. Salem, Halloween capital of the world, or so they say. <laughs> Who do I hang out with? Hmm. You join a coven, a lesbian coven. Is there any other kind? <laughs> you hang out in graveyards and perform rituals to speak to the dead. None of which ever work, but that's okay. Cause I get a load of old tombstone rubbings to decorate my apartment with. That sounds like a pretty spectacular plan. Great. Then come with me. To Salem? Sure, why not? Doesn't have to be our first stop, but one day. I still have friends in Seattle who book shows. Maybe we start there or, I don't know, Kansas City, Vegas, wherever we want. Look, I don't want to pressure you, but I've seen you give so much of yourself to make sure other people get what they need. And I guess I wonder if you've thought about what you need. I mean, obviously, I like you a lot, Alex. You mean the fucking world to me. Hmm. What should we go for? Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me.
You don't have to decide anything now, okay? <laughs> Just think about it. I will. Thank you. I'm gonna head back down. Find me later. So what should we do? Should we leave town or go with Steph? Hey, Gabe. Can I tell you something? I think I solved it. Why you died. Who's responsible? Isn't that crazy? I'm out of threads to pull. Which is terrifying. Because on the other side of all this... After Typhon, after you, there's just normal life. I was kind of counting on you to show me how to do that. But I think I can figure it out. I just wish you were here to see it. Oh, um, also... I kissed Steph, so that happened. Alex, do you have the USB drive? I do. It's all here. Gabe's call, their secret plan, the cover-up. I need to come with me to the station. Alex, don't make this hard. What are we doing here? <sighs> Probably isn't how you pictured your first spring festival, huh? Not exactly. Coffee? Hmm. I'm all right. Thanks, though. Good. Because we're, uh, actually out. Then why offer? Pike, why am I here? <clears throat> the long and short of it is, Diane is charging you with stealing her USB drive. How did she find out? What the hell Did are you, you talking her? about? Did you steal this USB drive or not? At least tell me you looked at it. I plead the fifth. Sorry. Let's see. 
you're conducting an investigation into Typhon, right? Everything you've been looking for is on that drive. Despite my best efforts, the case is closed. The order came down today. I did what I could, but, you know, the evidence just wasn't there. Sorry, Alex. They closed the case already? Let's see. I have the evidence. Right here. It doesn't matter. Look. What happened to my brother wasn't an accident. It was criminal. The files on that drive prove it. That could be true. But let's say it is. The issue is you stole Typhon's property. I can't work with that. Let's see. Okay, I get the point. I'm sorry I stole the drive, but... Apologizing isn't enough. Alex, you're not thinking about this clearly. Seems pretty clear to me. Diane wants to charge you with computer fraud. That's a federal crime, Alex. Five to ten, easy. Dang it. She even sent us that text, too. Wow. You're telling me I might go to prison for this? For five to ten years? It's not that bad. Hey, I talked to her, and despite how angry she is at everything you did, she's willing to let it go. If you agree to drop everything, Typhon won't press any charges. Why the deal, though? She's only offering that deal because she knows I have her. She's guilty, Pike. Even if you're right, your only evidence is inadmissible. I think you should do it. Fuck that. I'm not signing anything. Alex. No. Typhon buried something in the mountains. Something so massive they ignored Gabe's call and set off the blast just to cover it up. Don't you want to know what it is? What do you mean, cover it up? Another blast, unannounced set off at the exact same time at the old mining site. And all of it happened just a few weeks before inspections were set to begin. Come on, Pike. It's all right here. Like I said, it doesn't matter. Alex, please, just sign the form. And we can both go back to the party. No. Alex, this is not an offer that you can choose. I said no. No is not an option. What are you so scared of? See for yourself. Shit. What could be in that envelope? Why is he so scared? Let's see. Let me see here. Hmm. Has high level of determination a fit I'm not even gonna go butcher that word. Has persisted beyond predicted pre brevement? Period. I think that's what the word pronounced. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Immediate action required. Threat priority one. Dang it. H plus B private investigation services. 
Huh. They sent out a PI? Dang it. Let's see. Huh. They even sent out a, a PI against Steph and Ryan. Dang it. Is this a threat? What did you expect? Huh? The Typhon, a global organization with billions in revenue, an army of lawyers, and who knows how many politicians in their pockets would just what, throw up their hands and say, you got us. Dang it. I don't know. I was just focused on getting the truth. The truth is that you have no idea what Typhon is capable of. Shit. Believe me, I want nothing more than to make these fuckers pay. I've learned the hard way that it's not possible. They're too big, too connected, too ruthless. You can hate me if you want. Call me a coward. But I don't want to lose you like we lost Gabe. Pike is terrified of Typhon. I bet if I took his fear away. But it's not just about me. Steph and Ryan are in danger too. Dang it. Fuck. I want to hurt Typhon so bad. But can I really put their lives at risk along with mine? Can we at least try with Pike? Risk taking Pike's fear. Sign Typhon's affidavit. Mm. What should we do? Let me see, because if we sign Typhon's affidavit, most of the townspeople will not lose a job. The ones that at least work with Typhon. And I'll be saving Ryan and Steph's job. Hold up, wait a minute. What am I saying? They took Gabe away from us. That we can't sign this. I gotta do it. Let's risk. Let's do this. Do you wanna risk your life over this? Gabe, Mac, Alex? Who's next? Fuck, fuck, fuck! Just keep your head down, dummy. You're just a shit heel. Typhon's major league. Typhon doesn't lose. Typhon disappears, people. Let them get killed. Not you. I know you're afraid. I am too. I know you think that Typhon is... Too big, too invincible, but they're not. I will bring them down. I just need your help. Hmm. Let's go with. If not for me, then for Gabe. Please. Fuck. I'll think about it. Please do. Thank you. Get the hell out of here. Really? Alex. Be careful. Let's see. Alex, come see me when you get the chance. Jed, 
All right. Those pictures. How long have they been watching us? And what will they do if... I have no idea what to do next. Maybe talking to Jed will help me feel better. First, I need to get out of this dress. All right, so let's do that by going to the dresser. Then after that, we'll see who texted us. Right, cool. Might as well go talk to Jed now. Let's check the phone real quick. Hmm. It was Avalanche special for me cream. too, Steph. Enjoy that ice cream. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Haven Spring. Got that. I'm Ducky. glad Ducky had a nice night. He deserves it. Real nice. Okay. I got to admit, this is a pretty great feeling. That was real nice. All right. Now let's go ahead. Well, actually, I saw something about the jelly bean. I want to see that. Hmm. Hector. Thank you. Let's see. Nice. Glad I was able to help him out. Let's go ahead and talk to Jed. Hey, Jed. There she is. Have a seat. Something tells me you've had a more exciting spring festival than you planned for. You saw Pike arrest me. And let you go, apparently. Then there's that business with Ryan and Steph earlier today. I wasn't sure why it took all three of you to work out Diane's lunch order. I know you're used to looking out for yourself. Gabe was like that. But Haven's a community. We help each other. I want to help you. But first, you have to let me know what's going on. Fuck it. What have I got to lose? Let's see. You know what? Let's take a shot first. <sighs> Just our friend. I think we can trust him. Let's see, how should we go about this? Typhon killed Gabe or Typhon threatened Ryan? Typhon killed Gabe. I have proof. What proof? I stole it from Diane. Emails and documents proving there was a second explosion the night Gabe died. To cover something up, Jed. Some secret they buried. I don't know what it is. I don't even know what to do next. But I'm not giving up. Not ever. Oh. 
I know what they're hiding. Oh? Hold up. Let's see. Please, Jed. What's the truth? What are they afraid of? Typhon's the devil that runs this town. I've been carrying their secrets for far too long. I know what they buried in the mountains. Tell me. I'll do one better. I'll show you. There, up ahead. What could they be hiding? Where are we? Middle of nowhere. About two clicks that way is the mining site where you search for Ethan. Five clicks that way is town. What is this thing? Ventilation shaft. They're scattered everywhere. Over the years, mines grow into mines, creating a labyrinth under Haven. What you're searching for is down below. Why are you sad? No. Jed. I'm sorry, kid. Why? Okay. Put the gun down. I tried to talk you out of it. Scare you off. I was sure those pictures of Ryan and Steph would do the trick. You're the P.I.? But you were relentless. Won't leave damn well enough alone. You don't have to do this. I do. Twelve years ago, I made a mistake. The kind of thing that you... You can't undo. But Typhon made me a deal. A way to save my town. Give my boy a normal life. I never wanted Gabe to get hurt. You set off the explosions? Go to hell. <laughs> he really shot at us. I can't, I can't even believe that the chapter ended like this. Out of everyone that I trusted so far in this game, Jed was that one dude. I didn't expect him to be put in that scenario. Like, wow. Jed really did that. I, I really trusted Jed too. Dang, I'm not even going to lie. I'm a little hurt about that. Let's see how everything turned out. Pike convinced Alex to sign Typhon's affidavit. Nope, we went along and removed his fear. Let's see, Alex gave her a rose to Steph. Yeah, thought that was a cool thing to do. Alex didn't set the bonfire. Ooh, on the couch. Let's see, Steph and Alex mused about moving to Salem. Hmm. Oh, there's even an option. Steph didn't meet Alex on the rooftop. I wonder what would have cost that. Well, I guess since you know. If we were to choose Ryan, all right, now I understand. Now let's see, Steph and Alex shared a kiss. It could have actually gone three different ways. Steph and Alex hugged. Steph didn't meet Alex on the rooftop. Hmm, all right then. But we chose Steph as our romance for right now. That's cool. Let's see, Alex and Charlotte shared a bittersweet moment in the festival. Or it could have turned out Charlotte felt weirdly detached at the festival. Our outcome was actually the better one. Alex didn't find Riley at the bus stop. 
She was at the bus stop? What? Oh my gosh, I want to do this chapter over again just to find her. I didn't know she was there. Dang it. Ducky joined the festival after dance with Alex. I guess, you know, that worked out. I guess I can feel better knowing that we helped out Ducky. Alex helped the jelly bean counter with the contest. Hey, you know what? I'm glad I did that. Alex didn't talk to the diner buyer. They even know that was a choice. Alex didn't help them admit their feelings. Aw, I didn't know about that. And I guess that's it. Let's go ahead and move on to the final chapter, I believe. Let's jump in.